Hundreds of migrants and refugees try to cross a European border. But these aren't real refugees. They're plain-clothed personnel helping stage Austria's largest ever border exercise. The government wants to show that it's tough on immigration while appealing to its populist base. There's a new border force joining soldiers and police, military helicopters on patrol and water cannon at the ready. The defence minister wasn't willing to answer our questions on the timing behind this operation. Why are you doing this now? Migrant numbers are down from 2015. The far-right interior minister is keen to say that this isn't about closing down the border but keeping control. It is the political responsibility and duty of a country to protect its borders or lose its credibility. You cannot do a U-turn. Hundreds of soldiers and police taking part in this operation along the Slovenia border. Now they're trying to show that they can control migration into Austria. Now this comes at a time when the European Union is split over whether or not to receive more migrants and refugees. The refugee crisis of 2015 resulted in more than one million people entering Europe. It played into the hands of populist parties across the EU. The numbers of migrants, however, has since fallen dramatically. But the issue still divides the European Union. Italy has turned away two aid ships carrying people rescued at sea. And now the interior minister is calling on European countries not to accept anyone trying to cross the Mediterranean into Europe. They want them processed at centres in an African country. But this is yet to be agreed, with Libya already rejecting the idea. But Europe's freedom of movement could be in jeopardy. And Germany's Angela Merkel is under pressure to act at home and abroad. Uh, this Friday. I said already on Sunday, we won't get an overall EU deal on all aspects of migrant policy at the EU summit this week. With Europe divided and migration of refugees still a contentious issue, we could be seeing more countries unilaterally adopting stronger border controls. Assad Beg, TRT World, Austria-Slovenia border.